to protect all your personally created designs and elements in the software, it is a good idea to do a backup in the event of a computer crash or in some cases, an uninstall and then reinstall of the software. It is also a good idea to back up certain items so they can be transferred to a second computer. Any designs that you have created and saved on your computer should be backed up. These do not disappear if you uninstall and then reinstall since they are saved outside the program. However, it is a good idea to back up the designs to place them on a second computer or to have in case your computer crashes. So to do this, I can go to my embroidery files and select my designs folder right click and copy and I have created a backup folder on my external hard drive called software backup and I'll just right click and paste the designs into this backup file and then all my designs will transfer over to that folder. If you've created a personal thread chart this is not protected during an uninstall so it is important that the chart be backed up. This is also very helpful if you wish to have the information on a second computer. Any thread charts that you have added from sources other than those that came from the program should also be backed up. I find the thread charts that I've created in my C drive and program files x86 the Bernina folder and the Bernina Software 8 folder, and they are found in the RES folder. So here I have backed up a couple of files. One is the Glide file and the other is a personal thread chart that I have created. I can right click and copy that file and come over to the RES folder and paste that file in the RES folder. And now I have a copy of my personal chart in my Embroidery Software 8 program. I can do the same on another computer and I will not have to recreate that chart. Custom patterns, stamps, and borders are also not protected during an install of a new version. These items are best backed up so they will not have to be recreated. These can also be transferred to a second computer that has the software installed. I've put these in a folder and I can select all these and then copy and paste them into my program. If I'm backing them up, I will select the ones that I want to be backed up in my embroidery software program file, and then copy and paste them into my hard drive. Personal templates that you have created, whether they are basic templates or fabric templates, should also be backed up. These are found in your program files, Bernina folder, embroidery software 8, and in the template folder. Open the template folder and hold down the control key and select any of your personal templates. Right click and select copy. Go to your software backup folder, create a new folder called templates, open it, right click and select paste. If you have created any personal hoops, these can be backed up by going to your program files x86, Bernina, Embroidery Software 8, and the RES folder. All the created hoops can be backed up by selecting User Hoop, right-click, select Copy, go to your Software Backup folder, and right-click and select Paste. You should also back up files in the Quilter program, such as quilt blocks that you have created, as well as scanned fabrics. Scanned fabrics are found in two places. Fabrics scanned into the Quilter program are found in Program Files, Common Files, Wilcom, and Fabrics. Hold down the Control key 
to select any fabrics that you have scanned into the software, right click and select copy, go to your backup file and create a folder called scanned fabrics, open it, right click and paste. This is also where you will find any blocks that you have created. So under common files, open up blocks, select any block folders that you've created, right click and select copy, go to your software backup folder, add a new folder and call this quilt blocks, open the folder, right click and select paste. The second type of fabric that you may have added to your software is a scanned fabric that you placed in your background folder. To find this, you'll go to the C drive and users and public and public pictures and you'll find Bernina 8 pictures. These fabrics were placed in your fabric folder and you can right click on your personal folder, select copy, go to your backup folder, right click and select paste. If there is any doubt about whether or not to back up a folder or file, back it up so you'll have it if you need it.